Hey guys, what's up? This is Gum, and welcome back to The Darkness 2. We're gonna be playing the Vendetta mode, which, uh, I didn't know what it was really, although someone told me that it's basically a full-on campaign that you can either do in co-op or that you can play by it yourself. And since I don't readily have, like, random people to grow out of myself to play co-op, I'm just gonna play on my own. Uh, so hopefully this won't be too hard, and hopefully we'll actually have a pretty solid story. I, I, I like little side things uh, that could expand onto the main campaign, so let us get this started. Okay. What are we doing? Click. Oh, I can choose. Sweet. Huh. So I could choose one of four characters. We have the Asian dude with the sword. We have, uh, Jimmy Wilson with his axe. JP Diamond with his shaman hoodoo voodoo stick. And then Shauna with her shotgun. I want to play the samurai dude. You just convinced me to not go as you, actually. Okay. Okay, boys. Stay sharp. Stay alive. Actually, there are little things to read, but I'm seeing their personalities. Let the good times roll. <gasps> to our ends, the means are justified. Let the good times roll. You sound like Lee from the Walking Dead game. It's time. Let's dance. Hmm. Unique weapon, midnight stick, darkness power, black hole, innate talent, heart destroy healer. J.P. Dumman was a respectable African-American doctor, a descendant of a Creole family who went to live in the New Orleans area after the emancipation of population. Turning to a former Louisiana voodoo, uh-huh, to heal his patients, his desire to heal the poor and needy backfired. Alright. Lasses, grab your lads! And fellas, grab your nads! Uh, showtime! Okay, so we can summon Darklings and he has damage resistance. <laughs> I will taste suffering this night. He has more sprinting, and he has swarm. Finally, time to move. And she shoots the shit out, people. I'm gonna be this guy. It must be about our dark deeds. He seems like he heals himself. Uh, difficulty. We'll say him, man, because I played the campaign like this. Vinny. Now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna get right down to business because we're in some serious shit here. Somebody tried to take out Jackie tonight. And he's all right. But mark my words. Somebody's gonna answer for this. Now, Jackie's got his thing back. And from what I understand, you people all share his, uh, unique abilities. We need you to help us figure out who the fuck's behind all this. That's why you were called here tonight. This is a chance for you guys to prove yourselves, all right? So first things first. There's this guy, Johnny Powell. Guy's some kind of hippie... Ghostbuster talks to dead people or some shit. I don't know. I don't ask questions, and neither should you. We heard he got picked up by some no-name crew. We got him at the old junkyard downtown. Go get him, and bring him to me. I'm looking forward to doing my part for the cause. Good to know, Dr. Awesome. Now move. <laughs> yes, sir. Who are you calling sir? This is a family lady, not a military operation, Gabish. Yes, sir. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Let's get steaming first, you peely wally. Uh, yeah, what he said. Not even a pint? Oh, wait and boil your head! Yeah, exactly. Go get him, sunshine. They shall bleed in your honor. Sure thing, pal. Get moving. Alright, let's go. Let's begin the mission. In Vendettas, friends who have died in battle rejoin once a checkpoint is reached. But since I'm on my own, things are gonna be different. Oh, boy. <laughs> Can't embrace the darkness, but I do have black hole, which is kind of cool. Ooh, so we get whole new trees. Extends the duration of the black hole. Black holes can suck in more enemies. Further increases the size of black hole. Oh, man. Life giver performs revivals faster. Gives a short-lived invisibility after destroying a heart. Any midnight stick kills or hearts destroyed by shortening the cooldown of JP's black hole power. Interesting. I want to experiment with these guys because he seems like a healer guy, and since I'm playing by myself, I have a feeling like I want to be able to heal myself, although I don't fucking know what I'm talking about. 
No, don't come over here. I'm trying to listen to the conversation. Greetings, I'm the doctor and, uh... Got a friend? Oh, shit! Named Clementine! Uh, eat nothing but pain. Ho ho! Oh, shit! My midnight stick fucking lifts people in the air? Oh, man, I thought I just beat people down with it. Pow! <laughs> Boom! I destroyed his heart. Here, have a black hole. Destroy heart. So I don't know what destroying hearts does for me currently. It might heal me, it might not, I don't know. Oh, <laughs> but it's still cool. All right. Are you okay? Ah, oh, jeez. Can you? Oh, I can't shoot out lights. What? Well, I guess it doesn't matter since you know I don't exactly have the darkness. I have darkness powers. I don't know why. You're gonna beg for death when I'm through. He's already dead. Hey, Doctor Detroit. Any signs of Johnny down there? I sense the presence of your friend nearby. This guy's real important to the boss. He's an expert on all that dark shit. A fellow darkness student, huh? I look forward to making his acquaintance. Yeah, yeah, just bring him back in one piece, please. None of that crazy voodoo shit, all right? Don't mock what you don't understand. All right, all right, just keep your voodoo shit away from me, all right? <laughs> That's a reasonable response. So wait, people can just learn to harness the darkness? Interesting. <laughs> okay, I'm just, I'm just saying. Oh, no, no, jeez. So we get the same, uh, Jimmy, and that should be fun. Uh oh. Your soul tastes sweet. You know, just because you like the darkness doesn't mean you have to, like, pretend to be like the darkness. I'm just saying, you don't have to be crazy. So, yeah, that definitely heals me like it does in the campaign. Oh no, there's a guy over at the other end, hiding behind a wall. <laughs> Disable the gate's electronic locks. Yeah, sure. Any progress? I will have your friend in hand shortly. Thanks, pal. You're the best. And when I return, you should let me help you with your ulcer. My what? Wait a minute, how'd you know I have an ulcer? It's a simple remedy. Some mild snake venom and some ancient roots and... And I think I'll stick with the over-the-counter shit, okay, Dr. Crazy? <laughs> yeah, no problem, Vinny. Okay. I really like Vinny. In fact, I guess overall, I just like the characters of the game. They're all different. Even if they're all like a bunch of stereotypes, that's okay. Whoops. Dr. Breaking Pallets. Me? Did you just call me a dinosaur? I'm not old, I'm... I'm disciplined! I'm getting too old for this. You're not helping me, alright? You're not helping the argument. Everyone's permanently young. Maybe I should be the Irish guy, because he can summon Darklings. Also, apparently... You can... you can change the... Voice of the Darkling somewhere? I don't know where that ever was, but whatever. I made in the main campaign. I never, I never checked because that was never something that I figured you'd be able to change. It was just a British Darkling. It's like, all right. By the way, I'm assuming you watched the Let's Play already because this isn't going up until after the Let's Play is already complete. But if you're not, that's alright too. Uh, he's oh God, there. Please don't kill me. I'm not with them. I swear. Say, Johnny, don't worry. I just gotta, I had to destroy. The generator! Eh? Ah, survive the attack. Uh-oh. Hey! I'm trying to free him over here! I can't have you back here trying to shoot me! Get out of here! What am I doing? I just need to use my Kalashnikov! Oh, that, that actually heals me quite a bit, too. Nice. 
I need to upgrade my my uh, my powers. So that way I can use the eating of the hearts or the destroying of the hearts to decrease my cooldown. And make me invincible. That's also a pretty good plus. Can you imagine being able to heal yourself and then immediately afterward not even being able to take damage? Ooh. I am invincible! Fly! Oops. Oh! Oh! Ho! Holy shit! Wow! Don't step on a crack or you'll break your own back! God damn! I mean, that wasn't even breaking shit. That was just full on. Oh god. Oh. Ooh. oh, oh, oh. That is just uh man. Can I do I get any other ones or that every single one just sn snapped in half? We good? No, we ain't good. Back. All right, that was pretty sad. Just get all the people, just not even break their back, just twist them in half, yank them apart. That is just fucking too intense for me. But oh well, I'm alive and they're not. Don't kill me, please. I'm here to save you, Johnny. Didn't you see me? Oh, I guess you can't really see anything inside the room. All right, let's cut you free. <laughs> uh, darkness is talking Please, to me. Help me. I'm, I'm doing that. Holy shit, holy shit, thank you, thank you, thank you. You saved my life. Hey, wait a sec. Uh, you guys stink like dark essence. And that means. Ah, shit. You were sent by Jackie fucking Estacado. That's <laughs> not good. I'm pretty sure he wants me dead. Fuck me twice. Well, go on, take me to him then. Out of the frying pan and into the fire. Actually, he just needs your help so that everyone can survive. So, yeah. Good for you, Johnny. Hey there! Yeah, th thanks for saving my ass. And, hey, don't worry about me. I, that stuff I said about Jackie, that, that's all in the past. We're buds. Best friends forever. Two peas in a pod. He'd never, never kill me. He'd never hurt a fly. The guy's the best. Mm -hmm. Look, the boss said not to hurt you, so you're fine. Now get down to business. Yeah, okay, yeah, right, totally fine, okay. Um, th 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 I'm safe. I haven't been blindfolded or tied up or guarded 24-7 by guys with guns and low blood sugar. Tell them what's up or I'll tie you to that chair again. All right, all right. Uh, uh, you guys, listen, there's a, there's a ton of dark energy flowing through this city, all right? This shit is everywhere, and, and, and it's rising. I can, I can feel it in my fingers. I can feel it in my hair. I can feel it in my balls. It's, it's been going on for months. I, I know you guys feel it too, okay? W w maybe, maybe all of you don't feel it in your balls. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I, I, I was investigating a strong source of dark essence when those assholes nabbed me and dragged me down to the junkyard. I think what's ever behind all of this is tied to the darkness. <laughs> you guys need to go finish what I started. Head down to the broadside and find the source of the dark essence down there. Okay, yeah, I can, I can do that. Do I have like an in-between mission thing and select between? Nope, just back to me and uh, the salmon. All right. I don't like folks. I don't, I don't, I hear enough voices in my head. Like, I need another one? Oh. Are you there? Sorry, sorry. I listen. As soon as you guys find some answers down there, I want you to check in with me. Got it? Oh, okay. Good. Bye. We'll take care of it. I, I knew I could count on you. You're you're a doctor and all. <laughs> Doctors never lie. Except for that guy in the hospital who said my mosquito bites were chicken pox. <laughs> Fuck that guy. <laughs> Thought we finished here. What? Yeah. No. Wait. Hold on. That that cudgel of yours? It's a midnight stick, isn't it? They told me you were a darkness scholar. I read a lot. It passes the time when I can't sleep, but it, it does seem to quiet the voices in my head. Sometimes. The midnight stick is my conduit to dark essence. It opens a portal in the great emptiness and takes the wicked down where they belong. Charming. That's... Give me a call when you got something on the dark essence down there. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, I'm hanging up now. <laughs> Not talking to you, Doc. Poof. Alright, let's see. Nearby darkness users get slightly higher maximum health. Adds knockdown impulse around enemies fired up with the midnight stick. 
Oh, I like- okay, alright, so I can just go down- up this path. Ah, oh, but I have to get the dark aura. The problem with a lot of these abilities on this particular tree is that a lot of it assumes you're playing with other people? Improved damage resistance for the other players, more health, revive them. This one's actually a nice little side. The impulse knockdown, so when I lift up enemies, it'll knock down everybody around him. I just don't like this base one. I don't want a base ability that's useless to me. Anyways, let's see uh, what's going on over here. Increase the size of the black hole, infinite darkness, and extends the de Okay, I might need that. And this tree over here is not all that long. Right. So, uh, basically, I'm gonna be going up this tree, and this tree. So that way I can have a really good black hole attack. And then I can recharge the black hole attack faster. Although maybe I should go for the black- Yeah, I don't really plan to use the black hole thing all too much. Because it sucks in everybody, and when you suck in a lot of people, yeah, uh, With a black hole, uh, it destroys all their hearts. I'm losing my mind. My whoa, hey, whoa! What the fuck? Where'd you come from, pal? Uh-uh. I couldn't see his head, so I decided to shoot his knee. Yeah. Oh, he came from that door that I didn't notice opened. Do people really die if they just get shot in, like, a random area too much? I wouldn't know. I've never died to bullets or been shot by one, either. And hopefully it stays that way. Why did it need to fade the black if he was just gonna close the door? Ooh, uh, midnight sticky. Oof. I like how I don't like dramatically fling it forward. Uh oh. The world it acts for a race that depends on your value of life. Touche. You really should start a union, you know. Haven't I heard this conversation before? I don't even know. Uh oh. Let's get the party started! Ah, but first I gotta destroy his heart. Because every little bit of essence helps. I guess to be fair, if I want- if, I, if I'm only doing it for the points, Black Hole Kill will give me like 35 each. Any progress finding the source of the dark essence down there? Nope. It'll be done soon. Patience. Patience is in short supply over here. Can I- I'm sorry, can I ask you something? I just- where did you find that midnight stick? It just looks new. I fashioned this myself from a tree struck twice by lightning. I needed a weapon to fight the evil that was growing in my city. You are kind of awesome, you know that? We should hang out when this is over. The Midnight Stick guides me, and keeps me on the path to redemption. Yeah, well, uh, see if it can guide you and keep you on the path to the Dark Essence down there, got it? Okay, see ya! <laughs> okay, and he's gone. And it gives me health too, so I should just I'm execute everybody. There's a lot of fucking people in here. But it's totally okay because I'm only playing on like Hitman. Uh, carbine. Hmm. Hello to you too, pal. Get out of here. You see, I see this green button over here, and I or this green light, and I think, oh, I should press a button. But there's nothing on it. What the? Hey, what are you doing? Oh, I guess you're the last guy. There. Overload the circuit breaker, powering the thi- Oh, circuit breaker? Is this it? No. It's here! Connected to that thing! Oh, and then I press the button, see? My instincts are always right. Usually right. Eh? Oh! Eat nothing but pain. I should probably take cover. Because they're way up there and I can't get help from them because they're fucking assholes. Of your sickness. Oh, hey! Look, they're down here now! Good! I'm pretty sure a guy got past me over- yep. 
to the right. Execution! Oh yeah! Uh, you'll go beg for death when I'm through. You can't beg for death with their head shot off. You should be using the midnight stick exclusively if you want to be all that threatening. Because like, POW! Being sent to the air? Ah, that's pretty scary. Oh, you're gonna feel worse than this, my friend. Ah! Whatever will I do against the one guy who's down on the floor where I can't reach him? Sup! Oh, I didn't get it. I went to try and get the, uh, the fast heart thing again. Overload the secondary circuit breaker. Secondary? Okay. That means I gotta go across the way! Boop! Now what? Are we done? In this particular area? I see something inside of that. Yeah, there we go! <laughs> Pick up the darkness. Artifact. Are they going to try to turn me against Jackie? What? Whoa! No! Whoa! Darkness! You can't do this! This is power. Do I still get their hearts? I do. Hey, something just happened. I could feel it! What's going on? This dark relic we discovered requires further study. They were using it to print some kind of symbols I've never encountered. Alright, I need to see that relic and the symbols. I also need a burger and some fries while you're out. The food here is all Italian. <laughs> Just run a wax seal on some lowlife named Swifty. It's got a strange symbol I don't recognize on it. Maybe there's a connection between all these things. You don't recognize it? Uh, there's a difference between... I don't recognize it and... Uh, oh, whoa! Oh no, it can't be what I think it is. Uh, never mind, never mind. Wax seal, the, the, the relic you found? They share the same insignia. Whatever's behind this is tied to the darkness. Which pretty much means I started wetting my pants again. <laughs> I still have no idea what those symbols on the printed paper are, though. By the way, it was a hell of a burger. <laughs> You're welcome. I need you guys to find the guy who owned the place who used the relic. Name is Luigi. He's a gun runner and a counterfeiter. The relic belonged to him, so go grab him and, and do all that creepy shit that you guys do. Okay. Gotta go, bye. All right. <laughs> Look at me. I'm a regular mobster now. <laughs> Watch your mouth. Show some respect. <laughs> right, right. Jeez. Can a guy have any fun around here anymore? I'm a regular mobster now. What you saying? Ah, uh, nothing. 